Who knocks on the door? Every morning, someone knocks on the door of my house. I wake up to the sound of the door. I do not know who is knocking on the door every day. When I come running and open the door, I do not find anyone. I find the place in front of my house very quiet. I only hear the sound of birds and the rain. I live alone, and these sounds really bother me and scare me sometimes. I called my friend who lives outside the country. I told him what was happening to me. He was surprised at first when he heard my talk. Oh, John, living alone seems to have made you imagine things that don't exist, his friend said. No, I know very well what I'm telling you. There's really someone knocking on my door every day in the morning, John said. Please, John, try to sleep well. You look exhausted these days. You have to relax well. I ended the call with my friend. I was upset. He thought I was crazy because I lived alone for so many years. I tried to explain to him. He unfortunately didn't understand me well and didn't believe me. I got a headache because I think a lot about what's happening to me. The night came and I decided to go to sleep. I went to sleep and took off my slippers beside the bed and I drowned in sleep. Is it true what my ears are hearing? I was trying to lie to myself and continue my sleep, but the sound of the door became more and more loud. I decided to get up and open the door. I quickly put on my slippers. I knelt on the carpet because I was in a hurry. Really strange. I opened the door and did not find anyone. I waited a little in front of the door until I know who is knocking on the door. I didn't find anyone. The weather was too cold, and I couldn't stand much in front of the door. I went back to my room and my bed. I couldn't walk well because my knees hurt so much. It was a hard night. I went back to sleep again. Every day it gets worse. I don't know how to sleep well. I don't know how to eat well. I get nervous most of the time. But I decided to find a solution. I thought a lot and found the perfect solution. I thought of sleeping during the day for one day. And getting up at night behind the door of the house. I went out and came back in the middle of the night and found no one in front of the house. I kept awake until the morning behind the door. I felt sleepy but did not lose sight of my eyes. Suddenly there was a knock on the door. I opened the door quickly and found a tall person. Finally, sir. I found you. Where are you? He said to me. I was worried because I had never met this person before. Who are you? What do you want from me? John asked him. I am an employee of the gas company, and I want to check your gas meter. I came often in the morning. I was knocking on the door, but I did not find anyone. Gas employee said, "How is that? I opened the door every time and I didn't find anyone." John said to him, "Oh, sorry, sir. I've been knocking on the door and go quickly because I have a lot to do," he said. "I was surprised when I heard this. I did not believe what happened. What does this mean? I think I overdid it. I had to think rationally." It's been strange days. I think my friend was right. I shouldn't have worried myself so much. I finally knew who was knocking on the door in the morning. I was so distracted. But wait, there is still a question. 
Who knocks at the door in the middle of the night? The end.